So we wanted to, it's the holiday season, we want to share some of the holidays with you. Um, so we've got a couple traditions in our family of cutting down a real Christmas tree, so we're going to show you that. And we also go out for a, a great uh, Christmas party with all our staff. So we've got some of those highlights in this video. Stay tuned for the end of the video to watch our full treatment. Um, but we wish everyone a happy holiday season um, and you can share some of our traditions with us. All right, so we're gonna go wake up Fletch and try and get him for his first Christmas tree. Hey Fletch, Fletch, what's up? You ready for your first Christmas tree? Your first Christmas tree? Are you ready? One dressed baby. Look at those shoes. And I just realized my hair is a complete mess. But the nice part is, it's winter. So we get to wear winter hats. Oh. <laughs> mm. Who is that? Mm. Who is that? I'm ready to go. I'm gonna get your hat though. Okay, mommy, we're ready. This is what happens when your wife doesn't like your hat. Sorry. Oops. Mmm. Much better. Yay, this is the one. Woo, look at that tree. So that it doesn't dry out, gets lots of good water, puts a hole in it so it'll fit on the tree stand. One last mile and a wave. Bye. Bye guys. <laughs> Can't do that. <laughs> it would be better, I think. It would feel better. If you <laughs> I don't think you want me to cut your foot off. Now are you growing the mustache for November? Yeah. Awesome. One Good more day. One more day, yeah, exactly. And then are you cutting it off? Well, me and my son usually hang on till Christmas. I don't see him till Christmas and then right. see what he's got and we compare. Oh no way, that's awesome. Like going to be on TV? Maybe. <laughs> no, it's part so we can educate people on kind of what we do. Yeah. And you've got some really good kind of thick nails that we can show people how, you know, yeah. how you can treat them. Awesome. So we're going to do these ones first and then we'll go to the big toenails. Now the reason why you do that is because these ones are infected the most. How's that look? That one's a bad dude. 
Yeah. A little one. Yes, we'll make it come more comfortable for you. So you ready for the holidays? Pretty much so. We, awesome. We go back to the house that I had before. Do you? Awesome. How my, do you? My son bought it. Oh, nice. It's the biggest house of the group, so we go there. And he's pretty kind to us. That's nice. And we go to this one. Remember we were talking about Dr. Ho? Yeah. And you warned me about it. What What's wrong with that? Well, because what happens is, is it's a, it uses like a, an electric stimulation, yeah. right? And so what can happen is, is if you turn it up too high, it engages your muscles, right? That you can almost get stuck on the machine, right? Because your muscles are contracting so much yeah. that you can't move them because the machine's contracting them so much. Oh. So you just have to be careful with it, right? Yeah. Because uh, uh, that's happened before. Um, I should almost, that, that would be a good idea for a tape. But because we've, I was at, um, I was at my in-laws, grandparents. I don't know, what, how do you call them? Your in-laws, grandparents. <laughs> Anyways. And so I put the, the, the pads on the feet and then the, on my hands. Yeah. And my brother-in-law wasn't looking and he, he had the gauge. And I was just like, just turn it up, see what happens. So he turned it up. And then all of a sudden he turned it up all the way and my muscles were contracting. My feet were stuck, but I couldn't move. No. So like I'm sitting there and like my arms are contracted. My muscles, like my feet are contracted. I'm stuck to the machine. I'm getting a little f feeling in this foot now. Yeah. Uh, at a, uh, about three and a half or four. Yeah, so that's good. Uh, I was hoping to get a little bit more circulation in that foot. Wait, so it'll help stimulate the the circulation for a certain amount of time. It's not just it, you're you're not going to all of a sudden your arteries aren't going to unclog, so to speak, and you're not just your circulation is just going to become miraculously better, right? Yeah. I'm sorry about missing my appointment yesterday. Don't worry. We got you in today. Yes. I had it written down as a... You can thank Amber for that. Yeah. <laughs> I think Katie did it actually. Okay, go ahead. I'll, I'll take the credit though. Yeah, yeah. He was uh... And then she put, it, put us over in Guelph. I don't have a car anymore. I gave it away. <clears throat> yeah, Guelph would be a little far for you guys to go. You go to Guelph too, no? Yeah, I have a clinic in Guelph as well. So, which has been fun. It's been a lot of work, but it's been fun. Yeah. Have you got a helper now? Yes, so there's three of us. Oh. Yeah, so Guelph's been fun. It's been a lot of work, but it's been fun. Yeah. And there's me, Chad, and Alexandra now here. Yeah. Well, that's good. Yeah, it's awesome. Tickling? Yep. I got some feeling down there. Yes, that's a good thing. our best form of advertising so thank you we appreciate it so John 
these are fungal nails. I know I've told you this before. Um, yeah, we could write you a prescription for a topical. I think I did last time. Are you using it? I used, I used up what you gave me. You gave me a sample. Okay, yeah, so... We'll look at it at the end then. John, do you guys raise money for Movember? Um, my son, his group got about two thousand dollars. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah, he, he works in a big building. Great. What's he do? He's a, a programmer for a computer. Awesome. And his wife works at home. She has an office at home. Wow. Occasionally, he can stay home and work out of the office. Yeah, that's nice, eh? Yeah. Imagine you could do policing from home. <laughs> Imagine if you could have done policing from home. <laughs> Wouldn't have been possible, but it would have been nice, right? Yeah. <laughs> Relax your foot. Does it hurt or just tickle? It hurt a bit. Sorry.
You see, we lost a couple more guys. Sorry? We lost a couple more policemen. Yeah. Too bad. I've been retired longer than I worked there. That's crazy, eh? See that? That's fungus, okay? Yeah. So that's where you want to use the antifungal medication, okay? Okay. What's the other one then? They're all fungus. And I know we, we, we prescribed you the medication before, you just gotta fill it. Getting tired? Am I getting tired? No, this gal here. <laughs> I'm hanging in there. She's done it before. She's skilled now. She's an old pro. She's an old pro. <laughs> All right, now we're just gonna do the bottom of the foot here. See these little circles here? That's how you can tell that there's fungus. So using that cream too, okay? All right. And then we're just gonna work on this here. Okay, I'm just gonna put some cream on your feet and then you're good to go. <clears throat>